Welcome to a bonus game squat. That's so right. First one we've ever done. So this is this is a special well, first first bonus one we've ever done. First bonus one we've yeah, ever done. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. So uh what we're gonna do is we're gonna take uh two games from uh you know eighties, nineties. Probably the eighties, give or take five years, right? Yeah. I like to I like to say eighties, give or take five years. So that means like nineteen seventy five ish to nineteen ninety five ish, anywhere in between. Hopefully it falls someplace in the eighties, nestled comfortably in the eighties, Chris. Somewhere in there. We're going to take those games and we're going to talk about them. And then we're going to try to make up a new game from it. We're going to try to make up a sequel. We're going to try to make up a prequel, maybe a little side story. So uh, let's let's go, Chris. Tell me tell me what you have. All right. what, so, was, what was randomly chosen for you, sir? I'm going to show Kenny. Now, oh. this is a different name. Okay. okay. So what, what's the game? It's... Uh, he he it's shows the picture and then says it's, it's a different well, game. Well, it's Power Moves, power but moves. it's actually... It's Power... Original title was is Power Athlete. Um, power Athlete but is I the got original power title where? For um, the Mega Drive and say in uh, Genesis. Okay, what's it called on the but Genesis? I got what I on the Genesis. It's Power Athlete, but I got it for Super NES, which is Power Moves. So when I first got it, I was hard to find Power Moves. I had to research and be like, oh, this is really Power yeah, Athlete. Redirected from and yeah, blah, 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 all that. So stuff. Okay, gotcha. I got Power Moves, which is Power Athletes for the Super NES. Oh, perfect. Okay, Chris, you're gonna. Oh, you're going to be so excited. I got Air Zonk for the... Could you hold it up away from your microphone so I could see it? Air Zonk for the... Oh, for the TurboGrafx-16. Air Zonk TurboGrafx-16. Wow. Let me tell you about the TurboGrafx-16, Chris. No, let me tell you about Power Moves first. Then you can tell me about it. Go on. Tell Power, me about moves, Power Moves... Um, okay, so Power Moves is basically a Street Fighter Fatal Fury ripoff. Okay? As was every single... As was every single 90s one. Fighting. This was 1993, Kaneko. Um, it was three-button fighting. Okay, with um, you know, you, the, you know, what were, the, what were the three buttons? Punch, kick, and what? And then the combo. There was a combo <laughs> punch and button. kick together. Oh, there was a button. Oh, you, so you no, could... you had to hit punch and kick together, and that was your three buttons that you did. Your three, that was a. So I what, considering that a, as three buttons. The, the Super NES controller, if I'm not mistaken, Chris had two buttons yep. on the top. It had four buttons on the side. Oh, I'm sorry. One of the buttons was jump. Sorry. Gotcha. Yeah. So, so one of the happened? buttons was jump, and your power move, you could hit the punch in. To, to, to the attack so you can buttons, hit those two buttons yeah. right together. to do the so to like three buttons so, so you're gonna tell me that there were three buttons unutilized yeah basically yeah on the controller um yeah that one and so like i said the combo button was the two like the two attack buttons. what would make sense to me on that is the sega genesis had three buttons on the controller yeah a b and c yeah so it might be they just remapped the buttons and they just didn't bother probably it's probably what they did. So in this game, what you had was, um, again, it's it's just a knockoff fighter. Yeah. You did have RPG-like elements where you, you were able to um, boost your attributes after your fight. You'd get, like, points that you could put into things, and then you could, you know, rank up your your guy. Um, yeah, you were one character. His name was Joe, and that was the protagonist of the game. And that's it, man. It's a two-plane fighting area. That's just where it was. And there's a bunch of characters, which I won't go into the, you know, into them right now, but... Basically, that's it, man. Fighting game. All right. Knockoff fighting game. What do you got? Knockoff so, knock fighting game. So I have Air Zonk for the uh, TurboGrafx-16. Air Zonk? Air Zonk, which, surprisingly, you might think it's like like Bonk's Adventure. What? It was a, it was a shooter. It was a shoot. Oh, it was, it was a, a side-scrolling... It was it was a uh, delectable Is shooter. that an arena? Like, what was there that? There were a lot of Very good, colorful. There were a lot of good... Um, shooters on the turbo very graphics. colorful now this was released i believe after the turbo duo came out and they tried to have this be ma the mascot as bonk was the mascot for the turbo graphics 16 zonk was the <laughs> mascot for the turbo duo by tti it wasn't nec anymore they they call the turbo That's, technologies okay. where they kind of nec and hudson soft banded together made turbo technologies incorporated gross so what you have here uh 1992 92, okay. 1992, developed by uh, Red and uh, Nexsoft, I think it was, or Noxat, something like that. Oh, I can't even read my own handwriting. It doesn't matter. So I, Red, do I need to say yeah, it? Yeah, Turbo Technologies, Hudson Soft, it was published by. It's a shooter. It's a futuristic bonk. He looks a lot like bonk. Yeah. Um, but, you know, he doesn't really use okay, his head. So they have some kind of the same. I'm not done. Okay, I know. Go ahead. Sorry. <laughs> Whoa. Sorry. Sorry. Where's it's fire. Sorry, you know I don't mean? know. I'm just I'm, my, my gears are going, man. I'm trying to figure well, out. Paneling's still good, man. It is true. You're right. Yeah. You see that erupt? Then, then you can rush okay, me through fine, this. Okay. okay. So what we're gonna say here? 
<laughs> you you were able to select a companion in the beginning of the game to help you out with special moves. So yeah, you multiple, some cool multiple things. like yeah, different yeah, ones? multiple yeah, multiple little companions to use in there. Um, some of the did they do anything though? Those companions? Yeah, they'd, they'd come in and they'd. But ever, did it, did each of them have their own special? Th- they thing? would. Yes, they would help you out in a different way, which was why you'd choose one over another. Right. So okay. yes. Yeah. Yes. And you did, you did that at every level or you, you chose that you select your companion character. I, okay. I, I don't want to tell you if you can choose it in each <laughs> right. I don't know if you can rechoose after you die. I got you, yeah. Um Well, then start of a new I, level, I didn't yeah. I didn't I didn't, didn't get, get that, that far, far into it. Okay, you know, yeah. you know what I'm saying? It's, yeah, I got it's you. been a while since I played this game, Chris. Yeah, okay, true. Cuz it's been a little while. Well, look, there was only 10 Turbo We, we, we can play right games, after this so. if you like. Maybe, I don't know. So, anyway, uh you can charge your shots. Uh, some of the characters that you could choose were from the original box adventure. Kind of cool. Okay. All right. And then you get uh, seven smileys. All right. You pick up the little smileys. If you played box adventure, you got these little smileys. In the right. Game too. Uh, this game, if you picked up seven smileys, you, sorry, six smileys, you get six smileys that look kind of like emojis and you get them and Arizona would take them. Once you got the seventh one, the seventh one you'd see on the screen would have sunglasses on. When you get that one, you powered up. Okay. That's how you got your friend. That's how your little friend came into the game. Okay. All right. That's all I have to say about that. Okay. Good game. Very colorful. Very fun. Uh, Box Adventure, if you never played that one, was awesome. Box Revenge was awesome. Uh, Box 3, never really played that one. But I'm sure it was awesome because it was on the Turbo Graphics. Gotcha. Let's show the peeps. Just, I'm, I'm gonna, let me get you some actual gameplay footage. Get oh. some gameplay footage here. Yep. Yep. Let's, let's check it out. I got it. Generic fighting game. He wasn't kidding. He really wasn't kidding. In fact, so I remember when this game came out, Power Moves on Super NES. I remember this. I I never played it. It looked too much. I'm like, I'm already playing Street Fighter. Why would I want to even play it? All right. This so game, tell you know? me some of these characters that are in this game. Every you know every spot I picked on here is a bonus stage. Yeah. Tell me. I know oh that. God. Tell me about it. Tell Jeez. me some character names. Oh really? Yeah. Oh gross. Need to know. Fine. Because the thing is, now we're gonna take these two games and we're gonna put All right. them together. All right. You had Joe, the main character, Warren, a Hawaiian grappler. You had Rayon, a token female fighter. Uh, Vagnad, a huge wrestler with onyx skin. Nick, an arrogant, lightning quick matador. Bua, a kabuki style There's fighter. Too many names. I am. Galuan. I, 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 don't, I don't care what they do. Baraki and Rancor. Rank, rancor? Like the, like no, the Rancor. Rank, not Rancor, Rancor. <laughs> rank, rancor, he's got some guy that like cries. He's a non playable final boss. Yeah. Some, some dude, his manager cries every time he gets defeated. <laughs> yeah. Rancor. <laughs> Ranked you out. Oh, you ranked him out. All right, so what do you want? There's That's your what you 80s got. Talk, yeah, oh, there's 80 talk. All right, yeah, All right yeah. so we need to somehow. I would like to. I would like. I'd like to go to the. Oh, you want to go to, I to, go to the stream? Yeah. Okay. I, I want to go to the stream and I want to see what you guys think, how we should mix up Air Zong for the Turbo Graphics with Power Moves uh, for the Super okay, NES. Cool. Uh, graphic, if you're still there, good night. Thank you for stopping by. We appreciate it. Anyone else who's left, what do you guys think? How should we combine these things? We'll Just leave it up how, to you. How do you want to combine these things? Yeah. What, I mean, what, well, what, what do you think we There's a do? bit of a lag, so while we're waiting for them to get yeah. their, little, their votes in, I mean... <sighs> I mean, we have fighting again. Did it, we ever have it, a it's, fighter it's kind of... and a shooter like this? I don't think we've ever had something we like this. We just did in episode 56. Oh yeah, we had Seahawks I guess, yeah, and we yeah, had right, Wrestling yeah. War, I guess. or Wrestle War, or whatever the heck you called it. So we had that happen. Yeah, Pilot um, Slam. So we have kind of the same exact kind of thing. Now the characters might be fun. I mean, Air Zonk, he kind of flies and he kind of does his little thing. And everything what? Like that, why you know? doesn't anybody make? Why? Why don't we make a game? So, so you're flying right, yeah. and you're up and down, and you're back and forth, and you're flying around the screen, right? And you're shooting. Yeah. Why can't you have a fighting game like that? Why can't you know, like in like Dragon Ball Z and these shows, like they're you know, they're flying, they're falling and fighting while they're falling, or they're or Superman fighting mm-hmm. Zod or something. They're fighting in the sky, right? Mm-hmm. Like I said, DBZ. Why can't we do a game like that? I mean, I know they're Dragon Ball Z games, but why can't we do a game where <laughs> you're shooting while flying but fighting? Also, like you have to fight someone. While also defending against, is that too dumb and crazy? Like, if it could it be done in so a what, way, so you like leap up into the sky and you like punch things. Well, and... no, no, you're in, you're, you're, that's it. You're flying. Like, that's it. You're a person or a body or a, a mech suit. I don't know, whatever, right? Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Like, can we do something like that? Like, could you be fighting while fl- like traveling through the level, having these 
boss things and you know what I'm like saying? Like in the sky and everything like that? Like why can't... <gasps> okay, I, I, I'll be more concise. Double Dragon. Please. Double Dragon. Mm -hmm. Or, you know, like Final Fight, whatever. Mm -hmm. You're walking along and and guys come and you have to fight them. And then you move, you beat that guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And move. then the screen can move again. Why? They why? usually have the little arrow with go. Right. Beep, beep, or a little beep, hand. Yeah, right? a little, yeah, a little hand go. Why not little, have yeah, it? Yeah, a finger. Yeah, why not have your guy just flying instead of you? So you're not moving. The, you're being moved through the level. Yeah. But those things come up and you have to you have to fight them, and then go to the next one and then fight them. But in a fly in a, in a so, shooter. So okay. there are also things around you but that we, you but have to avoid. But this is a character shooter, so I don't think that wouldn't be a, that would be a problem. Right. So who would we use? Would we? What's his name again? Zonk? Zonk. Zonk. <laughs> Zonk. So Zonk can pick a fighter. Just a fighter. Yeah. To fight with him. Or do we use these as these mm. are the these are the guys he fights? Now I want I want there to be actual fighting. I want there to be the fighting. You're doing martial arts to these guys. You're not just shooting at so them. So Zonk is, is martial arts. Or Zonk is the guys. is the buddy that comes in and fights around. What if this was two players and someone could control Zonk while the other person's fighting the guy? Excuse me, Zonk is being flown around. So you can punch, you can be punching punch. a guy in his ribs, right? And Zonk is behind, like shooting him in the eyeballs. Either so him or game. him or other people. Yeah. So it's a two-player game. Yeah. And one person well, is shooting, be, and one person is punching. It can be a two-player game. So it's like a role-playing game where you have one person as the barbarian, like swinging a battle axe, and the other guy and then being you have range, the archer. Yeah, <laughs> yeah he's range, right? So one's a tank, one's a range. No, but well. If it's a one, if you're playing one player, that'll be an AI controlled Zonk, and he's. But, but again, there's things coming at you also. Yeah, I understand that. You know, like, so I don't know. Right. I don't know. So, what do you so, think, man? It well, doesn't have to be do, any of that. Let's just do a two player. Let's let's veto whatever's on there, and we'll. we'll there's nothing go. on there. Okay, so go ahead. Let's veto whatever's on there, and we'll we'll say we're gonna go and and and. And do it that way. There's a two-player game, and one person's a tank, one person's ranged, whatever you want to call it. Okay, if right? that's what. Okay. Yeah, and uh, and they'll go. You go through the level, and that's it. You have to protect the fighter because the fighter can get shot, no problem. But you got little zonk or whatever like that. You're so flying around you around him, and you can take out all the enemies and everything like that. Right. But you can get swatted out of the sky. Right. If zonk, if if zonk gets hit. Yeah. If he gets it once, he's yeah. you know he can take so laser blast. You have to protect each other. Yeah. 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 So. Yeah. Right. And you're getting so pushed through. Cool. Yeah. So, uh, was that really power moves? Power moves, I guess. Power moves. And it's, it's such what's a that generic called? title. What's that called? It's Air Zonk. That's even dumber. Yeah, but you can call at least you can call it like Zonk moves or Zonk power. power. Out air power. Air, air moves. Air <laughs> moves. <laughs> oh well, I mean, I mean, air moves could uh, be a thing. No, we have to call it something with Zonk. Zonk power, Zonk moves. Do we? Zonk fight. Yeah. Zonk got your back. <laughs> <laughs> Zonk, watch my back. Your back just got punched three times. Zonk's your boy. Zonk's your boy. <laughs> my boy Zonk. Bring Zonk. Don't forget Zonk. Zonk. I, I, can I tell you, I hate that. I what, hate it. Zonk? I hate it. You hate Zonk? I hate the I hate that. Yes. That the Zonk. That, what, it's a the title dumb Zonk? name. It's a dumb name, and Air Zonk is even dumber. Your the video game based on Chris isn't going to be anything. It's not going to be Power Moves, Chris. But it's not. But I don't, there the is no game. But that's the thing. If somebody made a game based on you, it wouldn't be called Power Moves, and it certainly wouldn't be called Air Zonk. Right. Right. So what I'm saying is, I don't your know game is probably just going to be like. Breathing and eating. <laughs> like, no, that doesn't it. sound like an exciting game. I'm not doing you know anything I mean? but, but Chris, living in the game? <laughs> Chris is breathing. Chris lives. What That's you, my game? What do you want to call it? Well, what am I doing in the game? Am I... Your job. What are you doing in your job? <laughs> no, I'm it's Paperboy. It's basically Paperboy. <laughs> I'm a mailman, so that would be basically Paperboy. He's just throwing things in mailboxes. Oh, my God. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> You people? wanted your Yankee Trader? You got your Yankee Trader. Take your stupid package. Oh, they called because you threw the package. They called the office and tried to get me in trouble. Come on, oh, man. Oh, gosh. Better than Air Zonk. Chris delivers mail. Better than Air Zonk. 
All right. And power moves. All right. So so what? Would I like it, air what power. It, what would <laughs> like it be, air power. So if they made a game based on you, what would it be called? Uh, Crystal versus the mail, I guess. If that's what I'm doing. No, it'd, be called, it'd be called like like like. Can it just be called Chris? It'd be called Mailboy. Mailboy. Oh, whatever. There you go. We got Mailboy. We diverted. Wait, what? We have a wait, special hold on. episode. Wait, hold on. And we made a video game based on Chris's life, wait, and it's wait, called Mailboy. I didn't know this was happening. <laughs> you heard it no, here first. No, hold on. I didn't know this was We're, happening. From we we hit the reset button. No air zonk. No power moves. We got Chris mixed with his life, <laughs> and we got Mailboy. For the TurboGrafx-16. Yes. It's, Are you in this? It's still on TurboGrafx-16. Oh, Kenny's the one trying to get me in trouble. He's TurboGrafx. I'm the one on the Kenny's big wheels throwing, that comes out Kenny's of the Kenny's driveway. And letting, and letting his dog out. And yeah, the Grim Reaper. I'm the one dressed as the Grim Reaper. And don't forget all the over. wasp nests that I have in the mailboxes when I open them. That's you're 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 putting them in there. That's fair. It's a two player game where they yes. play Kenny trying to thwart me. It's from like doing spy my versus job. spy. It you is have to, like, exactly. Hide yeah. The traps and then you it's have to Kenny trap versus them. Chris. It's yeah. 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 So there you go. All right. It's called Mailboy. Wow, that's a first. Chris. That's a that's a double first. Should we call it Chris the Mailboy? Chris the Mailboy. That's double first. That's a bonus episode and uh and a complete reset. All right. Pretty cool. Find us, find us at Retro Squat everywhere. At Retro Squat, that's right. RetroSquat.com and everywhere that you want to get retro. Looks good. Later. See ya.